Hi and thanks for joining me on this Rack'em Up video where we explain how you can use the scoreboard function for your team matches. The scoreboard function is designed to be used on a tablet that's local to, uh, to the table that you're playing on but it could of course also be used at any point in time if two captains just uh, either perhaps one of them isn't technically proficient enough to, to use the, the captain's mode um, or they just don't want to. It's just an alternative approach to entering your scores. Uh, first things first, you need the log the match code. The match code can be found within your dashboard or it can be provided to you by your league administrator. I'm just going to pop this match code into the, uh, into the, the clipboard there. And I'm going to visit the scoreboard app at rackamapp.com forward slash scoreboard just like you do for competition matches. If you enter your match code and press access scoreboard you get access to the scores. You can see here I've got the team names, the home team on the left and the away team on the right, and you can indicate who won the lag. And what you can see is there are no names present here at the moment. At the start of the match, you go into the editor, and within the editor, you can enter in your lineups. You can do this one section at a time if you choose to, but of course you do need to make sure all players are entered. As it's an editor, it will come up with the win and dish options in, in this so that you can uh, change them in case somebody's made a mistake. But we're not going to enter them at this point. We're simply going to choose our players. And if I close the editor, we can see here the names now appear for the people that are uh, participating in the first frame. If I indicate that Tracy won the lag. OK, we then get our options for who won the frame. And when I choose the win option, I can choose whether it was win by break edition or not. Press submit. And that submits the frame. And you can see the names change to indicate who's next up on the, for the match. If I then set the Corbin won this frame. And perhaps Leslie won this one. Then we can see this is updating all the time. If I've made a mistake, we can go back into the editor. And we can just alter this to say perhaps Sean won the first frame. And it updates the scores. We hope that provides you some use. If you need any help or support, as always, just get in touch with us at hello at or via our social media channels. Thanks for watching.